there's an epidemic spreading. Scientists say it can change your brain. It can release dangerous chemicals like formaldehyde into your bloodstream. It can expose your lungs to acrolein, which can cause irreversible damage. It's not a parasite, not a virus, not an infection. It's vaping. Every school in the nation is having a problem with Julie. And parents, grandparents, even students think that there's nothing in these little jewels. They may even think that they're USB drives. Uh, you charge them on your computer. And these have 59 milligrams of nicotine in one little container, one little pod. Whether you smoke or jewel, you are inhaling nicotine into your chest where it passes through the thin membrane of your lungs and into your bloodstream. From there, the nicotine is carried to the brain, and within seconds, it binds to neurons in the reward pathway of your brain. Nicotine can wake you up if sleepy or calm you down if stressed, so it is no wonder nicotine is extremely addictive. More and more students are bringing electronic cigarettes to school because they can't see the smoke, you can't smell it. It's, it's difficult to catch students. We have to see that they've got the electronic cigarette or the cartridges on them, and if they do get caught, then we have to follow, each school follows the code of expected behavior and conduct. Everybody needs to be aware what's in these. These are not just water vapor and flavoring. Know that there's lots and lots of nicotine. There's 59 milligrams of nicotine. There's one pack of cigarettes of nicotine in, in this jewel. So know what your kids are doing. Try to be aware. Don't assume that there's nothing in there. It's not okay for kids. It affects the kid's brain, it slows the growth, uh, so the impulse control, it, the decision making, and that's going to affect kids in the future. And that's why we're starting this educational campaign throughout the district to educate students, staff members, and their parents because we care about their health and well-being. Vaping can deliver nicotine to your brain, reprogramming you to crave more and more. Don't get hacked.